When caffeine-laden stimulant pills became available here at the upper room, customers flocked to it and parents damned it, claiming the capsules and tablets were falling into the hands of naive minors. Owner John Brewster withstood the attacks and opened a second location in Norfolk. Now he is ready to expand once again into this store on West Mercury Boulevard in Hampton. But Mr. Brewster ran into a snag here in Hampton. The city refused to issue him a business license to operate as Beach Pharmaceutical, citing a state law that makes it illegal to call a store that doesn't sell prescription drugs a pharmacy. So what did Mr. Brewster do? He took the city to court this morning. And he lost. Judge Edgar Massenberg finding for the city, but the Brewster's attorney says his clients will prevail. That It's a legitimate business. It's a legal business. Uh, a similar entity is functioning in the city of Hampton and in other surrounding neighborhood cities. It's just a question of uh, getting it in the posture that uh, the city of Hampton is uh, comfortable with it, I guess. The proper posture, Christie concedes, may simply involve a name change. If done, Hampton will have its second stimulant shop. Indeed, a peek inside shows the shelves already stocked with pills. Pills PTA groups in Hampton have asked the government to declare illegal. A long shot, possibly, but probably the only chance they have to keep these doors closed permanently. In Hampton, Joel Rubin, The Daily News.